And FPV Drift now all strapped in and ready to go. So now awaiting its own. And they're taking a, there's a shot of the fly line. There he is up into the air. And that is gate number one as he goes through and into the chicanes. A little bit of a breeze picking up. Nothing too bad, but uh, hopefully that'll hold off. It will hold off the bugs at the very least. A little bit eager before going into the uh, gate number three. into the corkscrew. There's a lot of different ways guys kind of approach this corkscrew here. You can keep the drone flat and uh, keeping the bottom, you know, the, the shiny side up and just kind of yaw it around and, and, and turn it. Or you can do the flips. Lots of different techniques there. There's uh, now through gate 8 here. He's at the U, the uh, hairpin turn of gate 9. You can see a gorgeous day out there for flying. Whatever kind of uh, flying machine you might have, but the quad flying is great. So there's lap one with 40 seconds to go. That was a, uh, he is on pace to hit a second lap on there, or he is on his second lap. Um, the scoring computer estimates based on that last one, a 224 two lap race. With 21 seconds to go, that will most likely be his last lap. Into the split S. And three, two, one, that is two minutes. And all he needs to do is finish his race to pick up those 10 points. The U-turn of gate number nine. All the tough stuff back behind him there now. It's a matter of collecting gate 10 and finding the starting gate. And uh, here he comes for his 10 points. It's FPV Drift to add himself to the leaderboard. And there's your results for round one heat number three. It's FPV Drift on his solo race, collecting two laps in a time of 220.411. That puts him on to the top of the leaderboard for the day. It's FPV Maverick, Foggy Minded, and FPV Drift all at 10 points each after the completion of round number one. So it's gonna go by pretty quick today. We have three heats in each round. A little bit more action as we proceed through the day.